Can I just say, joined again by my old mate Jerry Armstrong. And Jerry, I've just think of the way around again, how to describe you, and then it hit me. Jerry Armstrong, the best footballer I've ever heard. What about that? <laughs> <laughs> but Jerry, that's... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Uh, internationals, Northern Ireland, Michael O'Neill, yet to get a win. Like, Jerry, to be fair, can you realistically make a case for the match against Russia? My heart would love to tell me that they, they can beat Russia, but my head's telling me it's uh, a tough one for them, especially with Kyle Lafferty out. He's suspended. And also they're missing Dean Shields, who's had a, a bad knee injury, and he's going to be missing as well. So the firepower's not going to be there. It's a really difficult match for Michael. Uh, players, obviously their confidence is going to be low. They haven't won a game at home. Uh, yet for, for Michael uh, in this uh, qualification group. So, uh, and uh, again, Russia four out of four under Fabio Capello. You have to fancy Russia to, to win that one. I, I would take a draw now if I was Michael O'Neill. What would Fabio Capello make of the fact that he comes to Windsor Park after travelled the world as an international manager? You know, I suppose you can only hope for what we always used to say a bad old night, you know what I mean, in Northern Ireland getting stuck in and doing exactly what they say in the tin. And you know, hope springs eternal. Uh, it does, and I would hope that that I, I would hope I'm, I'm wrong. I would hope that it's going to be a special night. There's thirteen and a half thousand fans will be getting behind Northern Ireland, but Russia's so well organised. And I know Fabio Capello as a coach. I saw him at Real Madrid, and when he was in Italy, he is a very, very good coach, and he knows what it's all about. I just think Russia's got a wee bit too much quality for us. I think a draw would be a fabulous result for Northern Ireland, but I still fancy Russia uh, to win the, the game. Uh, Michael has more of a chance though against Israel. 